Welcome back to the channel everyone. Just wanted to show you the progress. I feel like this is a lot of tomatoes in one bed, but it is what it is. I was planting until extremely late, but I did get most of the tomatoes all done. And now I'm going to try to do the peppers because like I said, it got extremely late and try to beat the rain that's coming here. And also this bed over here, the weeds got taken out and I'm gonna throw down the seeds today so that when it rains later on today into tomorrow, it should soak those seeds in. So, and over here, let me see, I did sugar snap peas all right here I did some uh, land roth I think they're called beans there and some strike beans and then I did um, some in the middle right here which are the Fendi beans and then I did some uh, like bean pole beans if that's how you say it well, anyway, they'll climb. So I also got that done. Um, so yeah, I stayed here pretty late. So I had practically the last tomato in. They don't look too, too bad. I was expecting a lot of shock. But not too bad. And I planted a marigold in this bed. There's basil in this bed with the tomatoes. I planted a marigold in the corner of this bed and one in that bed. So these two beds here are gonna be peppers, um, but the tomatoes are planted. A little close, I think, but that's okay, because I'm gonna keep them single stemmed, I think, for the entire season. But just wanted to show you the progress, and now it's time to get all the peppers in the beds before the rain comes. So quick video, hope you enjoyed this. And um, rain should be good for my sugar snap peas and the three or four different assorted beans that I planted. So just a quick update, quick video. Want to get um, the pepper plants planted before the rain comes. God bless you. Thank you to all the new subscribers. I hope you have a wonderful day. And I will see you on the next video. Bye, everyone.